it is Friday morning and um, I'm just finished up my oatmeal. I made oatmeal for me and Sean this morning. And uh, we've got a big day ahead of us. Do. Not me, really. <laughs> <laughs> um, lots of uh, lots of stuff. For you guys who don't know this, because I've not put it on the vlog unless you've been following us on social media, but Sean um, passed his real estate exam on Wednesday, so he'll be moving forward in that. But until then, um, he has been trying so hard to get set up with Uber to drive to make to carry us over. And we have had a heck of a time. Like, he would be, think he was approved, and then, like, um, something would happen. There was some curveball. You know, had to be registered in the state, and just uh, just all kinds of stuff. And every time you think he was ready, there would be some other obstacle in the way. So today is the day that everything is finalized, everything is done, everything is paid for, and he is going to be driving all day today. So, um, are you doing Uber Eats today, or just um, Uber? Both. Is it two different apps? No, Jan says it's not. We'll find out. Mm -hmm. Learn. So anyway, are you? Uh, I I yeah. uh, are you excited? I'm nervous. <laughs> I haven't had to talk to this many people in a very long time that I don't know. So we'll see. But <laughs> it is what it is. Um, I'm doing the Uber Eats because it's not a paid gig to be a realtor. But I'm very excited about that. And willing to do this this gives me some flexibility to see my baby boy and my wife uh, i'll just be out while they're sleeping sometimes but uh, at least god has opened doors for us to do that so um it is what it is um so he'll be out all day and some of the evening i didn't ask you though like uh i'll be out tonight i'm not sure what i'm making for dinner you gotta eat when you I get won't home? Be here. No. Yeah. Are you just gonna eat when yeah. you get out? No, no, no. I'll eat when I get home. So, anyway, should be an interesting day. He might get a couple clips on the road and send them to me so I can insert it in this vlog. And hopefully, I can get this one up tomorrow. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe I'll vlog all day. I mean, edit all day. Because I'm still trying to get my last vlog edited and up. So, anyway, it should be an interesting day. So, Sean is picking up his car for Uber. We can't use our car because um, our van, uh, the van door is broke, but it's not even that. You have to have registration in state and we don't have the money for registration yet and all that stuff. So, no way. he's renting a, you can rent a car to do Uber. Yeah. Really? That's cool. So, he entered a code in his Uber oh, it app. Even, it even has a little. Good. Um, let me turn this down. So, yeah, you can rent a car and it has like the Uber stuff in it that he needs and everything. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. Once he makes a little bit of money, we're going to get the van fixed and get it registered and everything. But for now, this works pretty good. So, he gets the first 12 hours free. So, he's working 12 hours today and he's going to drive for 12 hours straight. So, he has this car for today. 12 hours so so tomorrow he'll have to pick up a different car tomorrow you have to reserve a different car yes yeah I, I mean this one might be available they just want you to check and see if there's any damage so when he drops it off you drop it off here tonight yep so he'll drop it off here and um it has to be full of gas and cleaned up you know no not dirty or anything and then all the Uber stuff put back into, like the decals and stuff like that, airport pass, things like that, it has to be put back into the glove box. So he said he had, a, he was wanting a phone holder for his phone for like directions and stuff. And he said it even has a phone holder in there. So he was excited about that. He's definitely gonna learn the town today because um, he doesn't, you know, know his way around like some people do, so. <laughs> so we just dropped daddy off and with his Uber car and I was going out from there and I saw this cathedral, it's Episcopal church. And uh, I want to check it out real quick because I'm driving around the block. I don't know what I look like in this camera because I have it turned around. And I want to just kind of get a look at it real quick and see. It looked beautiful.
so just pulled back into the apartment um sean just called me and he had his first drive and um i think it was an airport drive and on the way back little man had a meltdown he i don't think he feels good because um well he was hungry and he hadn't had anything so i stopped at mcdonald's and got him something but he still is like crying and all red faced like his eyes are red he's been like crying all the way home so i don't think he feels good he's got a little bit of a you know in his throat and he had a hacky cough last night so i might see if I can, he'll take a breathing treatment today but he doesn't feel good definitely doesn't feel good we're getting out so now i gotta get groceries out i just picked up groceries from walmart so i gotta get him and groceries inside so this should be interesting well i just got home and i got all of like the freezer and cold stuff in i put it in his diaper bag actually <laughs> And got him in but um i need to go out and get the rest later but for now i'm gonna clean this kitchen up because we left it quite a mess yesterday um uh-oh i bought him some balls yeah balls ball oh oh my floor is dirty but i don't have anything to clean it like my my broom is out in the car so i'll have to wait till i go outside boom go get it all right, I might be able to clean. I might have to play with him for a few minutes. We'll see. Anyway, yeah, these dishes are atrocious, so I'm gonna clean it all up. Granny bear. Yeah. Oh, love. Can you love? Oh. This bear. A lady in our church after Sean's mom died, she took um, Vicky's clothes and made a bear for Chelsea and for um, Harrison. Really, really good work. And this is one of Vicky's sweaters. So, it has a little bracelet on it. Yeah, that's Granny Bear. They don't feel good, Granny. I don't feel good, Granny. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Granny's in heaven. Yep, yeah, this is our Granny Bear. Mm -hmm. She loved you so much. Oh my goodness, she loved you so much. She would be so excited to see you growing. And uh, all the fun stuff she could do with you. Yeah. She would be so excited. Mm -hmm. But she's in a good place. She's not thinking about you. She with Jesus. Yeah. She up in the sky with Jesus. Yeah. So, little man is just laying in bed watching his show. He does not feel good. And I'm just going to pick up my bedroom a little bit. Put some clothes away.
still working on picking up the house. <laughs> I haven't heard back from Sean other than the first phone call on my way home that he had completed his first drive. He seemed um, happy and, and, and positive. I'm just folding some clothes real quick. Uh, just put some blankets in the dryer, I mean in the washer. Um, he seems to be feeling a little bit better. Um, he's watching his show still, but he's at least setting up and just kind of acting like he wants to do something. Before he didn't act like he wanted to do anything, he just wanted to lay down. So, anyway, I know he doesn't feel good. I just don't know, you know, what to do. If I just need to do a breathing treatment, or if I need to give him cough medicine, or cold medicine, or, you know, what do you do? I just got a few more things to pick up. I'm going to fold these clothes and put them away, and then um, I might pick up our office and his playroom in there um, because he's got toys everywhere. <laughs> so I'll probably do that. But then uh, we'll kind of rest the rest of the afternoon and uh, see what happens. taking a little break I'm tired so I got me a drink what do you want granny bear you want to lay on granny bear okay. still not really wanting to get up I'm not that not that that's really that different than normal days if he's got his iPad but I know he doesn't feel good I can see it mama's no I'm using my tripod my big tripod today to film and I like it so much better. Something just fell. I know what it was. My kitchen window's open, and I have my chalkboard that I write messages to people outside that walk by our apartment. And I'm pretty sure the wind, I had the window open, so I'm pretty sure it just uh, fell. So yeah, this is what I do, is make little messages. Um, every day I've had different messages, like yesterday was Thankful Thursday, Wednesday was Hump Day. And I make little messages and I leave it on my window, like I shut the window with it on the other side because we have a lot of traffic that comes through here to get to the cars, to go to work and come home and stuff. And I thought, how could I be a positive light on this little corner? We're on the corner of this little intersection by the cars. And how could I be a positive light and share a positive message? And this is my way to do it. see <laughs> so yeah um, I even had a gentleman um, uh, stop me and say that he saw my messages every day so I know people are looking <laughs> on our way out it is like 7 17 and um sean gets off it he ends at nine tonight i look rough i know i am so tired too because little man didn't take a nap today so he is in his car seat and we're gonna go to target and get a couple of things for easter and then um you know drive around if we have to until time to go because i i couldn't stay at home and risk the chance that he might fall asleep and then i have no way to go get sean so and i gotta go downtown to get sean so anyway that's what we're doing we're heading out oh my gosh the sun is so bright i can't even see if there's any cars coming okay so anyway what we're gonna do is go to target and walk around ride around and uh, kill some time wow you can't see anything so, 
I've got Sean. Little man is fussing. He's still awake and he is fussing. Oh. But he had a good day, so um, I'm going to turn it off here. Thank you guys for watching and you have an amazing night um, or day. All right, good night, guys.